pregnancy is just one of the many phases of, of a woman's life where fantastic and wonderful things happen, but at the same time there might be the chance that further risk for diseases may actually increase due to these important hormonal changes that a woman goes through in some particular phase of life, such as in pregnancy, menstruation, menopause, Predontal diseases has been also associated with adverse pregnancy outcomes such as low weight birth or preterm birth or even preeclampsia. And in fact, the association studies showed that there is a kind of a significant uh, relationship between the predontal status and this kind of pathologies. We don't really know why. It might be the case that there is a passage of periopathogens in the amniotic fluid. It might be the case that subject that has that are pregnant and has periodontitis are also even more inflamed than usual and that might trigger some events. At the same time we also need to face that subjects that are pregnant and have periodontitis may also actually have risk factors for periodontitis such as smoking. There are also risk factors for the other diseases so it might be a common sharing of actually etiological factors in this respect. In fact the, I would say that the game is still, still pretty much open and we we'll try to really to understand what's going on. When we move to intervention studies, you know, the study that are aiming and treating subjects with periodontitis and subjects pregnant, of course, there is really not such a huge decrease or such a significant decrease of adverse pregnancy outcome incidence. And this might be the case that most probably we don't run the good trials that, that we would like to. Uh, in sample size may be underestimated, uh, it might be that we don't really have the proper uh, included subjects in the population of the study because maybe it might be the case that they're not that severe enough in terms of gum disease so that you might see some effects or most probably we, we don't get the right timing. Maybe we should run the trial before they would get pregnant if would ever that be possible. So it is very much something that we still try to understand. Scientific evidence demonstrates that due to the increase in hormonal levels during pregnancy, there is a clear increase in gingival inflammation during pregnancy. That means that the most important thing that pregnant women should be aware of is the prevalence of gingivitis. Uh, it has been demonstrated that uh, between more than half percent of the women will develop pregnancy gingivitis.